Good morning, super cool party people, and welcome back to the vlog. It is Saturday. Um, I woke up at, I would say, 9.42. That's like my wake up time. <laughs> and it is now 10.44, and I've just been chilling. I was laying in bed for a while, going through my phone and stuff, and now I'm at my computer watching YouTube and thinking, man, maybe I should be productive and just stop doing this. Like I mentioned last night, like I have a decent list of things that I need to do and honestly I'm really lazy and I don't want to do anything so I'm thinking like maybe I'll work on the masks right now for a bit and then feed myself and then hopefully I'll be awake and jazzed and ready to continue with the other things that are arguably more important so that's where we're at just wanted to start the vlog my voice has clearly not decided to wake up for the day but that's fine also the nails are holding up quite well um so that's cool. They're so sparkly. Like, I got some of the Holo Taco Unicorn Skin Nail Polish, and I'm like, ooh. And I was never into, like, the hollow flakes, but I, now I'm like, ooh. <laughs> so that's a problem. Anyways, just want to check in and hoping that this motivates me to, like, do something, but no promises. Alrighty, so one, two, three... <laughs> four and five masks ready to be top stitched. So that's great because it's like half the battle there. It's 11.30 now, so I feel like I've made decent progress and I think I'm actually gonna take some time to make my bed um, and then go eat. Part of me is like, should I just order food in? Cause honestly, that's how lazy I am. <laughs> but like the rational part of me is like, don't though. <laughs> so we'll see. Anyways. Um, Wow, my brain just stopped. Yeah, I feel more awake now, which is great. I mean, caffeine might have had something to do with that. And um, I think after food, I will transition to editing the essay because I really don't want to do that. It's only a thousand words, though, apparently. I looked at the, um, they sent me the, like, requirements for the essay. So, fingers crossed it's not so bad. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> My shelving unit arrived today, which was a little bit earlier than anticipated. And also my light box that I bought arrived today. And that's great because I still have not taken those pictures because I'm lazy. So anyways, I need to build this. But before I build that, <laughs> let us do a fabric haul because I went to Fabricland. Super boring, white cloth to use for my lining. Woo! <laughs> gotta wash it, gotta wash all this stuff. And then my mom's boyfriend came in and he picked out these ships, these trucks, and this nautical themed one. As if I didn't have enough nautical themed stuff already, like I literally have like 12, but it's fine. <laughs> I got some thread to match that and then just some white because I can always use white thread because I use a lot of it. And then this is like, I got two meters of this. <laughs> I only got half a meter of the other pattern and like three meters of the white but look at it it's sparkly I'm so excited I'm definitely gonna be making a mask out of this as well as like a million other things so yeah that's where we're at I'm gonna take off my jacket now and then I'm gonna pull out my tools just in case I need them and then I'm gonna build this shelf and hope it fits where I want it to fit like fingers crossed because it's giant and I really don't want to send it back if it does not work
well, everything is now a mess over here <laughs> and there. I mean, those are the clothes I still need to put away. This I had to take down and I'll have to relocate it. And then I had to take down two pictures. Those I still need to take pictures of, but you ready for it? Ah, oh. <laughs> it's so organized now. It's so nice. So I've got, um, my thread and stuff down here in the fabric I need to wash. I am getting like a shoe rack to go underneath this uh, toy box, which is where I keep my sewing machine. So I think I'll probably move this stuff onto that. This shelf is like my work in progress slash there's my elastic. I hung this here because it deserves to be on display. Also, yes, I know I need to like steam it or something. <laughs> this is a finished product. This is more elastic. This is, I have finished embroidery things in there that just aren't hooped. Work in progress, work in progress. And then fabric, my old, old sewing stuff, and then more fabric. It could be a little more organized, but like that is a massive, massive difference because before everything was just stacked high on this. So that's exciting. Yay. And now I need to like clean up the mess because I can't even get in my room right now. But before I do that, let us, I can't put that there because then if you put anything behind this camera, like where the viewfinder is, the screen goes blank and then you can't see what's going on. So can't put that there, but let's open up my light box. I was thinking about getting a light box and then I was like, well, if I have to take product pictures, it makes sense. So it comes with this little tripod for a phone. There's, there's the phone thing. <laughs> what's in the box? This one that I got is um, 16 by 16. It actually comes in a really nice carrying case. I think it was um, 36 bucks Canadian, but I can check. Yes, 36.98 is what I paid for it. So yeah, that's exciting. So it comes with whoa, a couple different background things. <laughs> so it's got a blue, a yellow, a green, a red, a black, and a white, so that is awesome. And they're just really quite large because obviously they gotta fill the whole box. And then here is the box itself and the power. Oh, nice, it's USB powered. I think I read that, but I don't think I took it in. Have you ever seen those jokes like how to keep an idiot occupied, turn over? That is what I feel like right now. I like how it tells me how to install, but not how to open it without breaking it. Okay, well, I don't need it right now, but anyways, there it is. I'll show you when I eventually get it set up. So yeah, I feel like we've made a lot of progress today. Um, I still, my room is a disaster. I still have to edit that essay, though when we went out, I brought my laptop, and so I got almost the whole thing like very quickly rough edited. It's not terrible. <laughs> like I think she could hand it in now, but I don't think she would do as well as she could if I like actually go through with a fine tooth comb and then I just have to confirm that it is cited in the proper um, citation type. <laughs> Uh, APA. Uh, I was in history, so I feel like it was always Chicago that we used at my, or maybe, yeah, I feel like it was Chicago. Anyways, I'm just rambling now. I'm very excited. To oh, it looks, it's so, it's so nice. Oh, I love it. That was straight up the biggest one I could get. <laughs> I um, definitely measured. There was, so this, what I got is I searched for over toilet shelves because I knew I had to go over the fridge and um, what I ended up getting was an over washer which is basically the same thing and there was one that had a bigger shelf on the bottom but it would have come out past the fridge door and then I wouldn't have been able to open the fridge door very much so I think that's the best way to go I think it's 13 inches is the one I got there was one that was 11 inches but I measured it I'm like pretty sure I can get the 13 inch one in there and I can so that's very exciting anyways I am going to try to get out of my room now through all this cardboard <laughs> And then I have to switch focus to something that is on my list. This was fun, but it wasn't on my list. Alrighty, so I got the light box open. Um, it's a lot more flexible than I thought it was. I was afraid I was going to break it, but it's all good. I haven't plugged it in yet, but I'm sure it'll work. There we go. La da da. <laughs> and now I need to sit down and edit this uh, essay because... I mean, it's not due till Sunday, so I said I would have it done either Friday or Saturday, but I do work Saturday, so I kind of want to just get it out of the way. I was getting into it just before dinner, but then I had to go down and cook, so now I really need to get into this, because I straight up, have, the only thing I've done today is make my bed. That was on my list. 
and then <laughs> tomorrow is the last September vlog that goes up which would be fine because I have the October vlog edited but I don't have an intro for October yet so I'm super far behind <laughs> basically where we're at um it's probably gonna be okay but I'm just gonna sit down I'm gonna edit and just hopefully get this done in the next hour or so I already got <sighs> like part of it done and then I need to finish I'm gonna say and do the other part obviously um so yeah Alrighty, so here's where we're at. I think the essay is just about done. I just need to do one last go through, but before I do that, I want to make sure that everything is cited in APA, which is what it needs to be cited in. I cannot find my cheat sheet or cheat notebook. It's not a cheat notebook. I like bought it when I was at university and it tells you how to cite in everything. So I was like, oh, I'll just do it online. And the internet is not working on my laptop. So <laughs> I think that means I should step away for a bit. So I'm going to do that. And I don't know what I'm going to do. Probably so. Uh, Cause I, I mean, I did so a lot this morning, but I can definitely finish these off. They shan't take too long. Um, but yeah, also this one's like it's so big. But my friend has a much, well, he's got a fancy beard and a much larger face than me, but that's my size. Anyways, that's where we're at. It's, yeah, it's going fine. This essay isn't that bad from some of the ones that I have edited. So that's nice. It sounds, it's sounding good. Anyways, I'm going to go because I'm just rambling now. And I guess I'm going to sew. Oh, but I can't watch shows if I the internet's out. Guess I'll listen to an audiobook. Rude. <laughs> Alrighty, so it is a quarter to ten, and I have just finally finished editing that essay. Um, I just I couldn't get uh, uh, English. The internet was working on everything except for my computer, so I just rebooted my computer and then it worked fine. Um, but it's still such. I much prefer like a tangible book to flip through when I'm looking for reference things because I know where everything is in that book and so it was a bit of a pain like going online and trying to figure things out so I th I'm like I think this is all right <laughs> um here's some suggestions if you need to do this don't know if you need to do that did your professor ask for that anyways so um I'll have time tomorrow afternoon to look at it if I need to if she wants to make some changes so that's good I guess <laughs> um I should really shower, I think, but also I want to sew things, uh, but also, uh... <laughs> yeah, I got nothing. I think I'm going to prop my laptop over here as, oh my God, I got to do the October intro. I don't know what today was. Today was just not what it was supposed to be. Anyways, <laughs> I'm going to prop my laptop over here on my stand as if I'm going to sew, but I might maybe try to take pictures of the scrunchies, but I'm like so unmotivated slash I should shower. I don't know, man. I don't know. Today's just been a weird day and I have to finish four of these five masks by Sunday. <sighs> Alrighty, well, it is now the end of the night. I got my scrunchies listed on Etsy. I was like really going back and forth because I'm like, oh, they're like almost all Halloween specific, but I was like, whatever. If I put them all together, it's only like, I think 20 cents for the whole listing, so that's fine. And, um, and then I got the masks all top stitched, so that's great. I probably could have finished them tonight if I wanted to, but I figure I should sleep because it's just after 12. I'll finish them tomorrow and then that will be good. And then I've got things to do tomorrow, laundry for sure. I wanna wash the fabric I got today and I need to do the October intro because tomorrow's the last day of a vlog going up. If I don't get it done, I don't have anything for Sunday. So crunch time, I guess. And that's where we're at. Anyways, I'm gonna go sleep now. So with that, thanks for coming along today and I'll see you tomorrow when we don't build more shelves, but I'm still like really just loving this. I can't wait to get some toast to go on there, but yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Good night. <laughs>